Oh look, it's GFP. Can't wait to meet him. Dude, I haven't been in a rig in a while. You're not Gabe Farrell. I'm not. <laughs> Another video. The last time I made a video was like a, a year ago, maybe, right? Yeah. yeah. Maybe like nine months ago, whatever. So I bought the pink truck and I said I was gonna make a lot of content. I made zero content and I just sold it like last week and picked up literally the same exact truck, a five speed single rear wheel. Just can't get away from them. The second gen, man. I'm turning into a second gen guy now. They're they're nice. They're really nice. This one, uh, it's a little different from the pink truck. It's uh, six inches taller. That's it. But as you can see, it is quite filthy. When I first got this truck, uh, Gabe is like, hey, he's like, I know you love this truck. He's like, you want it? And I was like, sure. So I bought it for 10 grand. And I was like, all right, there's no way I'm gonna lose money on this one. Like, this is a good deal and stuff. So bought her. And the first thing I told myself is that this wrap is not staying on for long. So I've had it for two days now and it's 40 degrees outside. So we're gonna see if this wrap comes off. I did this little section here and the paint is, it's, it's mint, um, which we all knew already. But like, look at this dude, like. Good wrap. Fantastic wrap job. This was the giveaway truck. It sat in a field for like a year. I guess it protected it, whatever. I'm not mad because this paint is like super soft. We're gonna change up a couple things. Maybe put some new wheels, new tires because uh, it needs new tires. So we're putting new tires on it and uh, Maybe some JTXs, 28s, maybe 30s. Um, then uh, it needs a bath. But I was like, why wash it when we're just gonna take the wrap off and it looks like this underneath. So <laughs> we're not washing it yet. The inside, everyone already knows about this truck. I don't really need to go over much, but full leather interior. Uh, it's got an iPad dash. It's a five speed, like I said. Um, iPad dash, no iPad. So whatever, but uh, got the dash cover on it. And these are gonna come off too. Sorry, GFP, but uh, I got a rep NP now, Nick Perino. Dude, am I supposed to have some special tool for this or something? Hands. I got two and they're not working. I quit, we're going in. Almost done. Almost done with 1% of the truck. We're never getting this done. <laughs> Today. Maybe it's too cold, dude. I don't oh, really know. Man. But dude, look at that color, dude. Probably like, look, like look, look at them next to each other. Like, come on. I at least wanted to get one thing, like one, door or fender the bed is a little big i wanted to get one thing done today maybe if it wasn't 30 degrees out now 32 it'd be done i'm gonna get roasted in the comments it's fine i'm getting cold you're cold yeah well let's just go sit in the, your new super duty and uh it's got heated seats right yeah that's a 90k truck right there all righty so we're going to the post office real quick because I went to go register the truck and um, something was wrong in the title. The uh, the date was a little off. Can't put one number over another number or else Illinois says, nah, f you. So um, we're going to the post office right now to mail out this paper, get it signed by the previous owner. And I was like, hey, uh, what am I supposed to do if I can't get a hold of the person who I bought the truck from? Even though I can, I'm not worried about it. I'm saying, but for someone else, like what are they supposed to do? And they're like, oh, uh, if you can't get a hold of them, then um, you can't register the truck. Well, that sounds kind of up to me, but what do I know? Obviously, we're taking the daily. 99K miles. I'm just going to break 100 on it and then uh, stop worrying about it. Because uh, after 100, I don't really care how many miles are on it. So I need an iPad, to be honest. That clock is definitely wrong. Got the old handy dandy vac and some glass cleaner. I don't like this very much, so we're taking care of this right now. Vac's not too bad. Gotta clean this up a little bit. Hey, it's got seatbelts. Yeah, um, I found out that the pink truck did not have seatbelts in the back, so if you ever driven in the back of my truck before, you never told me, because uh, I went to go sell it and the guy was like, 
there's no seat belts in the bag for my kids. And I was like, mm -hmm. apparently not. Apparently there's no seat belts for your kids. Sorry, man. So let's get to clean it. Being alive, people are probably gonna roast me, but uh, these are going to fucking garbage. I'd rather rock no mats, to be honest with you. Let's get the vacuum again. Much better. Oh yeah. Not bad. Got this big tool kit right here. I'm gonna do some hard work, hard labor, like a mechanic. Taking off the GFP sticker. Sorry, man. The time's come, gotta rep NP. And obviously we just gotta watch the paint. So here we go. Ooh, nice and easy. I know I'm doing a bad job. Oh, look at that. You can still see it, Gabe. You're still there, still in my memory. Super random. I think another mod we're gonna do is uh, on the pink truck, I had the metal wheel wells. I think uh, we gotta do that again and color match them. Cause, uh... oh yeah, don't mind my wrap. I, you guys already know I'm trying to take it off. It's not working out so great. But uh, yeah, like in the pink truck, that looks sick color matched. So same, you know, over here. Maybe in the back too. I didn't have them in the pink truck in the back, but if I could find some, might as well do it. When the truck's this big, the proper way to step in is, uh, well, you step on the wheels. Another day, sunny. The sun's been beating on this thing. This thing is coming off so easy now. I just gotta be careful. It's taking off some of these, uh, like little pieces on there, which kind of sucks, but whatever. But yeah, when the sun is out, that wrapped coming off really easily. Driver doors off. That pisses me off. The little spots, I'm gonna have to replace that because that pisses me off bad, actually. But uh, yeah, pretty much off, just the little little pieces there, but I'm gonna leave those on for now. Just wanna get the big like parts done while the sun's baking on it, because this is awesome. Look at that color. Why would you cover it with rainbow? The other side of the truck is still freezing, so I can only do half today, so it's gonna look a little weird. Already looks weird with this wrap on it. I'm not a pro, but we're getting there. Hydra 5.0? You finally got the car back? Yeah, finally. Why, why has it been gone so long? Got a new transmission. What happened to the old one? It was just a piece. Wait, what kind of trans is it again? 11 speed. Manual. Garbage. Manual. 11 speed yeah. manual. So you're driving a semi now? Yep. You got your CDL? Yeah, because I got a dump truck. <laughs> you're an idiot. Hydra 5.0 got that one. Uber for Nick, right? No. Oh, who's it for? Tim. Fuck you. Yeah, I'm Tim. Where's Tim supposed to be going? Just for a drive tonight. You're just not that trans. You're an Uber just t testing out your trans? Yeah, I'm just giving out free rides to the homeless. Wait a minute. Bro, get me out of here. So, uh, where are we going? AutoZone. Bro, AutoZone, you gotta go to O'Reilly's, bro. We'll go to O'Reilly's. I fuck with him. <laughs> I fuck with O'Reilly himself. Me too. I've known him since middle school. Really? Yeah. Bro, we got a Chevy SS in front of us, bro. Watch out. This thing will wax you, bro. I'll wax the shit out of anything. I got a fresh 10 speed straight from Ford. <laughs> this thing's whack. It's your third one. And look it. You're only at 31,000 miles. Trans temp. 187, bro. That's what happens when you're the fastest in Illinois, dude. It gets old beating everybody. I'm sick of it. Where's the competition at? Why is your heated seat on, bro? They're not even plugged in. <laughs> bro got the gauge put in for the so you could put on the heated and the cooled seats. He just got the buttons so it wasn't blank, but he doesn't have heated or cooled seats. I'm picking them up this weekend. From where? Florida. You're going to Florida? Yep. Zeus, are you in there? Bezos box. Getting that Amazon money, I see, buddy. Say it again. Real men go to O'Reilly's and real men drive five goals. Why are we even at O'Reilly's, bro? What do you need? What brand is that? It smells like chemicals. Yeah, it's chemical guys, dude. <laughs> You're a clown for buying that shit. Look at house. this. $28.99. Alrighty, that is it for this video. Did the wrap. Next video, this is what I want to get. I got touch up paint coming. We're going to touch this thing up. Make sure that there's no imperfections on it. I want everything done. Um, even under here, we're gonna do this stuff, all these. Drive shaft needs, that thing needs help. So 
I don't know what I want to do with that yet, but uh, I just want to touch everything up so everything is ready to go. I'm going to do these, but uh, next video, we're doing touch-up paint. That's the uh, that's what's going on, so stay tuned for that one, and uh, we'll keep grinding away on this thing. Uh, yeah, she's not, she's not fitting in the garage. Nothing I ever own fits in the garage. More touch-up paint. That's cool. So, next video, we'll, uh, we'll be touching up.